Massive out with the old and in with the old for the Silver Ferns heading into the International Series and Commonwealth Games. While the side has lost a shooter Jody Brown, several players have returned from the wilderness. Or in the case of Anna Scarlett, from the beach. Sean Summerfield reports. Ruth Aiken had an eye on the future today at the National Under-17 Netball Champs, but the Silver Ferns coach has looked to the past in naming her Commonwealth Games squad. Among the not-so-new names, beach volleyball player Anna Scarlett. It was never planned for me to do two and a half years and come back to netball for Com Games. That was never the plan. I had an Olympics uh, in my mind. Um, but the things that I have learned have, will definitely contribute to my netball now. While the All Blacks had their rotation policy, the Fern situation is more like a revolving door. While one shooter, Jody Brown, leaves to focus on family, another returns in the form of Danika Wipaiti, given a place in the squad after impressing selectors during the ANZ Championship. She's joined by fellow Sting player Liana De Bruin. It probably is, is a bit reflective of, of life for women, really. And um, you know, But I, I'm really excited with the group we've got. I think the reasons that um, players have for taking some time out are really valuable. It's not all nostalgia from the national selectors. Catherine Latu is also in the squad with a focus firmly on next year's world champs when the former Samoan international will be eligible to play for New Zealand. They've taken a chance on me and I'm real grateful for that but I've been working really hard and I know I have a long way to go and I actually do need their help. The 17-strong squad will be trimmed down to 12 for the Delhi Games and International Series following next week's selection camp. Sean Summerfield, 3 News.